How's it going guys? We are back out in the garage finally. I apologize for the lack of content lately. Uh, me and Tim have been really busy. Um, he actually just got married and bought a house. So they've actually been quite busy getting uh, their house fixed up so they can actually move into it. Um, so that's been eating up a lot of his time. Um, I've actually been in Toronto for work for the past two weeks and I just got back a few days ago. Now that I'm back, I uh, really want to get into getting this garage clean because uh, just before I left for Toronto, um, I tried getting everything ready for winter just in case we get snow while I was gone and everything. And um, basically I left the garage in shambles. Like it is just a mess in here. So first thing I'm gonna have to do is get everything cleaned up before I can even work in here. So anyway, when I was in Toronto, uh, wasn't a whole lot to do in my downtime. So what better way to spend my time than uh, to go car spotting? Um, so there were some days I just went out for a walk and just saw what kind of cars I could find. Um, other days we were just walking around downtown Toronto or just driving around. So I'm gonna get to work cleaning up this garage cause it has to be done. And uh, while I'm doing that, you can have a look at the cars I saw when I was out in Toronto. We'll see you in a bit.
All right, well, that is quite a bit better than it was before. So now I'm actually going to be able to get something done in here. So it's getting pretty late today, so I'm not going to get to much right now. But uh, I think I might start taking Frankenstein apart. Um, I want to black out the headlight housings for sure. I got some work that I want to do on the bumper. As you can see, it doesn't quite line up properly with the body there. So there's some uh, little tweaks here and there that I want to do on it. And uh, since it's parked for the winter now, I might as well start taking parts off of it and uh, just fixing the details and stuff like that. Um, the biggest thing though, once Tim's able to get out here, we need to get back to work on the Furious Civic because it has been far too long. The last thing that we did on it was in the summertime when we were doing body work and that's kind of where it left off. Um, we've been accumulating lots of parts for it though, so not to say that we haven't been doing anything. We got lots of stuff waiting to go on to it, so I think that's the next big thing that we're going to tackle. Um, got the prelude sitting outside on the driveway, we need to do some work on that yet, but I think the priority right now is going to be the Furious Civic, so uh, really looking forward to that. Hope you guys are too. There's just so much good stuff that we got to put on this thing. It's going to be awesome. Anyway, that's all I have for you guys today. I know it didn't seem like much, but uh, like I said, we've been away for the past two weeks, over two weeks actually. So um, this is about the only content that I could get for you guys. But uh, I just wanted to keep you guys in the loop, let you guys know what was going on. Um, and I wanted to put something out there for you because you deserve it. So um, if you like the video, uh, make sure you give us a thumbs up. Uh, make sure you hit that subscribe button if you haven't already. We got lots more exciting stuff to come. And uh, make sure you give us a share too. Uh, we're creeping on 500 subscribers. Uh, keeps climbing every day. So uh, can't thank you guys enough for that. Uh, let's see if we can hit 500 by Christmas. That would be awesome. Uh, we got something special planned for when we hit 500. So stay tuned for that. And yeah, we'll see you next time.